Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Today's video is on the Title 9, and in today's video, I'm going to be searching for more Dark Elixir to upgrade both of our heroes. I'm at 90,000. I need 130,000 to upgrade both at the same time. And in today's army, I'm going to be using, uh, I like to call it uh, a Go Jiwi Golems, Giants, and Wizards with a Queen Walk. The start of this raid, I'm going to put the queen at the bottom of the base with the, for the queen walk. And she is attacking the gold storage, trying to make sure that she goes towards the right side. Takes that gold store, or gold mine down. She does go to the right. I'm going to wall break her in to take out that storage and also try to target the queen in the base so she doesn't target my troops, luring the, them over to her. Putting down the main army, since I've made the funnel for the army. The wall breaks don't make it, so they had to go all the way around the wall that I broke at the start. Queen's almost dead, but they take out the rest of the defenses attacking her, so she's going back up to full health. Gonna rage the giants and golem and king in the middle of the base. And then gonna drop another rage once they get out of it. Yep, there we go, another rage at the top. Gonna poison the king to slow him down. King's down, we're all in the middle of the base. We are still missing 1300 dark elixir, which is at the top of the base. I don't know why, but I decided to put my wizards on the bottom. Could have used those at the top, but that's fine. I think I just I thought to myself that we're gonna get the three star, so I put the wizards at the bottom, but it doesn't really look like we're going to since there's only a golem up as a tank. The king just went down and we have the queen walk still going. But we only have a minute left and she has to go through a couple walls to get to that drill. Attacking the cannon, she had a couple cannons attacking her, but the healers are healing her up. Gonna use the ability to get through the walls. She attacks one wall to go through to get the cannon, and then attacks another wall to go into this last compartment to get outside the base. Attacking some collectors, but we're running out of time. It doesn't look like we're gonna get to the drill in time. Yep, we're gonna run out of time for that. But we still get 4,500 Dark Elixir, which is pretty good. It's a normal amount of Dark Elixir we get per raid. We're on to the next raid here. Gonna drop the Queen on the right side here. Just to have her go down for the main army to go in that big compartment at the bottom of the base. Drop on a wizard that immediately dies. Trying to get that gold mine out of the way so the Queen doesn't go up and target that. But she does decide to take out this drill, so I'm going to wall break her into the base. The wall break does work. She's going to take out this camp and then go into the base to take out these two air defenses. While she's doing that, I'm going to put some wizards down at the bottom of the base to kind of clear out those buildings so that when we do drop the golems and stuff, the wizards and stuff aren't lagging behind them. It's going to drop the golem now and the giants with the king and the wizards. Queen's almost dead at the top. Gonna have to use the ability there. The wall break makes it through. Gonna poison the queen to slow her down. Gonna raise the giants into the base. Queen back at full health. No point in using the jump spell since this is just a big compartment. Gonna jump those two compartments there. Gonna wait to use the rage to decide where the giants are going. They're gonna go right side. So I'm gonna drop the rage spell over there. We still have a bunch of wizards behind the king on the left side. Wizard taking out that mine on the right. We have the king full health with his ability. We also have a clan castle. We got some giants working on the wall up top. They break it. I'm gonna go for that expo, which is out of ammo. Use the King's ability, get through that Collector and Archer Tower. Queen 
queens attacking the town hall. Only a few defenses left on the base. We still have four healers up, so they're going to just keep healing the troops. So this is going to be a three star. Got the last building being an elixir collector. And it's a three star for 4,600 dark elixir. Back at the base, we did some season challenges, so we're going to collect the rewards. We get a, a rune, 10,000 dark elixir, a hero potion, and 15% resource boost. The hero potion we don't need since we have full, and I never really use them since the heroes are always upgrading. On to the next raid, we have a million of each golden elixir, and almost 7,000 dark elixir. It's a fully maxed base, other than the heroes, which are pretty low leveled. Gonna go from the left side with the queen walk. We're gonna start off the battle with putting a giant and a wizard down to take that drill out. Nice and easy, just in case we don't make it that far into the base. Drop in the queen with a couple balloons to just uh, see if there are seeking air mines, which they aren't, so all those healers behind the queen are fine for this area. Taking out that gold mine, only a Tesla attacking her. So she's full health still. Gonna drop a couple of wizards to funnel to make the queen go into the base. Just take out those buildings, gotta go down to take out a couple more. We are gonna go from the bottom of the base. So putting down the giants, wizards, and king. So all some wall breakers to get them into the base. Oh, never mind. That's a wizard I put down, not a wall breaker. Gonna rage and heal the giants and wizards into the base. Queen's up top, still working on a couple buildings. Gonna rage. The giants out out of the core of the base gonna drop these wall breakers on this wizard tower compartment soon. Hopefully, I, I'm pretty sure we do. Yeah, there we go. There's a single wizard, or there's two wizards attacking the town hall. They will take it down because they're in that rage spell. All the troops are on the right side of the base now. Queen still on in that same compartment from the beginning of the raid. I don't know what she's been doing this entire time. But she finally gets through it. Gonna use the king's ability to get through this wall. King opposing king is coming to attack the queen. But he does get taken down. The only thing left on the base is the queen. So we're not gonna be able to three-star this, so. Just gonna collect a few more buildings, probably take out this queen and then. Uh, probably just end the raid there. End the raid there, 85% 2 star with almost 7,000 Dark Elixir. We did get all the Dark Elixir from that raid, which is good. Another attack with 5,000 Dark Elixir. Dropping the Queen at the bottom of the base. With the, with the healers for the queen walk. Dropping a couple troops to make the queen stay in this area. Gonna wait for the mortar to attack the queen and then drop in the wall breakers. Once this shell goes down, all right. waiting for these wall breakers to go down. I'm waiting for something. I guess we're, the queen's gonna go in the, uh, around the base, but the opposing queen is attacking the queen, so I'm gonna drop a poison spell and a rage, but the ability goes off, so that rage is basically pointless. Dropping the main army on the right side, gonna wall break them into the base. He Healer is getting attacked by the air defense, but the air defense goes, does get taken down, so we only lose one healer there. Main army going into the core of the base, gonna drop a heal to heal them up and a rage to get them through all these high hit point buildings. Got a bunch of wizards on the right side, taking out a bunch of buildings. Taking 
looking at that last drill up top. King is attacking the town hall with the queen, taking it out, and taking out this final dark elixir, which is the storage. Both heroes' abilities used, so at this point, just waiting for the storage to go down, and we'll see if we are able to three star it. The king duck goes down. The only thing left to tank is the golem. So I'm just going to end the raid there. For a total of 5,000 Dark Elixir. Second last raid of the day. Which is 6,300 Dark Elixir. You're going to drop the queen right on top of the king. To take him out since there is a drill right underneath him. King isn't doing too much damage to the queen, so I don't need that poison spell. I'll save it for something else like skeletons in the base, or even the queen. I'm gonna see which way the queen decides to go, and I'll drop the wall breakers. She does decide to go right, so I am gonna drop those wall breakers just to see if she goes into the base. While this is happening, I'm going to drop a wizard and the rest of the army. I'm going to use the wizard just to funnel to make sure they go into the base. The queen will probably meet up with them once they're in the core of the base. But the giants do decide to go down since that wizard tower is far away from them. The closest one was that archer tower in the corner. I'm going to rage and jump them into this bottom compartment here. Got a, the queen is still up top in that sand compartment. Enemy queen attacking the king. And use a, the final rage on these giants to get them through these defenses. King ability used. We still have that dark elixir on the left side. And we still have the storage up. Queen is taking her sweet time through these storages. Gold storage going down, then she will attack the dark elixir storage. So I will use the ability just to get her through that. But we have that drill on the left side still up, which is 1700 dark elixir, which is a fair amount. I'm gonna see if these wizards are gonna get there, but they won't because that cannon will take them out. King is getting taken down, so the, really the only thing left to take out the drill is my clan castle balloons. Putting them to take out that cannon and then going up to take out this archer tower. Trying to see if they will take out the drill and they do. We've only missed out on 400 dark elixir which is in the town hall but that's not a big deal. Final attack of the day for almost 7,000 once again. Dropping the queen on the right side of the base with the queen walk. Dropping those balloons to see if there's any mines, which they, there aren't. Dropping a wizard and an archer up top this, to funnel for this army that's coming in right now. Wall breaking them in, but there's a wizard tower that oh, the wall breaker still go through. Gonna jump them in, gonna see maybe that other compartment got part of the jump spell. We're gonna see soon. It didn't, since those giants are attacking the wall. That storage is taken down. The last of the dark elixir. I'm pretty sure it's at the bottom of the base. I can't see it right now. Wizards, so there's a big bunch of them with the queen at the right side there. Dropping a rage for these giants. Yep, there's the drill at the bottom of the base. Gonna use the king's ability to get through this wall. It's gonna work on it for a while. Drop those archers just to get those buildings out so the queen that is going around the base will take out this drill. Those giants are working on the wall, but they finally get through it. Bunch of skeletons up there, so I will put down this poison spell to take those out since there really isn't anything else take them down. I'm going to use the Queen's ability to get through this drill and take out this elixir storage. 
And there's nothing really else left on the base that is worth taking, so I'm just going to end the raid there. Almost 7,000 Dark Elixir. Back at the village. Gonna, we have enough to upgrade both heroes. Queen going to 29, and the King going to 26. That is going to do it for today's video. If you enjoyed the video and haven't already, leave a like and subscribe, and I'll see you in the next one. Peace out.